Well, here's Olin Kruitz's response. Unreal, but I can't say I'm shocked is my response. Haven't talked to George since I left Hallis, but he knows me well. Crazy response by him. Just talked to Harry Heastan to confirm the offer again, and he confirmed it. Olin did go on to say on the radio today on The Score that he also spoke to former GM Ryan Pace, who also confirmed said offer. That makes George look awful. George should be embarrassed. I have heard from a number of former players since this all happened today who are not happy with George's comments either. You know, Olin still has a lot of respect that he carries from being that guy in the locker room. And I, for regardless of what was true or not true about what Olin said, and I tend to think it was true. and I, It was yeah, true. Yeah. Um, regardless of that, I just don't understand why you would take a shot at his credibility. You know, avoid the question. Try to find a I way. I don't think he knew. I mean, you know, I mean, would, that, would, would something like that get on George McCaskey's desk? Probably not. That's why I asked the question, right? though, because I, mean, I wasn't all, all you have to sure. say is, you know what, if that's the case, geez, I, I wasn't aware of it. I'm going to talk to Olin. We're going to straighten yeah, this out. Yeah. He's a beloved former Bear. And honestly, that's what I thought the response was going to be. So for him to come out kind of so strongly and, and question his credibility, I, look, there's already this divide that has started to happen between the Bears and some of their very popular former players. Correct. Who, by the way, played on the most r recent winning teams. That went to, that a, went Super to, Bowl. to a Super Bowl. I just find it remarkable that they've somehow treated them almost like enemies. They've alienated way. them. And George drew the line today actually talking about how he, w he is hesitant to get feedback from players who are in the media. And he said because he doesn't want to put them in a position where they don't know the difference between a confidential conversation and something that can go on air, which is another way of saying you don't trust them. Right. That's what you're saying when you say that. And I just, I think all of that put together made a lot of these guys, not just Olin. Olin talked about it because he's not afraid to and he was directly named in it. But some, some of these other guys I, 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 who I heard from, I don't think they're happy about it. Yeah, I thought it was embarrassing. And George should know better because I know Olin Cruz. He's a dear friend. That guy's telling the truth. So he and George need to get in a room and work it out. And it's on George to extend that olive branch. So...